Hey guys, Jeff Ryan here. I am super excited. Today is the day we're going to be doing the uh, raffle for the uh, steak truck, dump truck, the cab, all that little uh, special bonus package there. I've got everybody's name on these tickets over here. There's um, $5, one ticket, $10, two tickets. That's the premise. Uh, a lot of guys uh, got more than one ticket. That doesn't guarantee that you'll win it, but it does increase your odds. It does increase your odds. We will get to that drawing and I'll show you how I'm going to do it here in just a bit. Uh, this was in the last video of the vent here. It looks like it's got uh, the tattoo, tattoos. It looks like it's got the uh, stickers all over it, the decals. We're going to have to um, address that. The front screw post, a little bit of a crack. Don't know if it holds a screw well enough. And the back screw post, slight crack. Looks like it would hold a screw post real good. The back bumper should be replaced because of the uh, corner there. Now, the front bumper, I was looking at it just a bit ago. I could just touch that up or... Uh, get it out and put a new one there and the inside of it yeah the inside of it looks like it could use a bath so we are going to address that and uh, get that looking a whole lot better i should go ahead and get some parts of that i need the uh, bumper kit uh, what i need screws the guide pin chassis that type of thing all right let me gather some parts here is everything i think i'm going to need i if i need something else fine uh, i got it the uh, axles the small one and the tires because I don't want this uh, setting up there looking like a four wheel drive vet. So I'm gonna go ahead and <clears throat> change those out. Got the bumper kit, got a uh, couple of screws there, guide pin. So we'll get uh, underway here and we have to clean up the body. I'm gonna take that and get it soaked in some warm water and try to get the decals off. That should only take a sec. Okay, I'm, I'm at the sink. I got this uh, side done. I still got some uh, more yet to do, but the warm water, uh, your thumbnail, plus I have this uh, toothbrush. It's like a baby's toothbrush. It's very, very soft. It's very, very soft. It's not gonna mar or scratch the plastic at all. So let me go ahead and get it back into the water and get the rest of it cleaned up. All right, very good. I, I think I did good. I'm gonna, it's still just off. I'm gonna take it back out to the garage, dry it off, and see if there's any uh, little residuals that I missed. Got it dried off. I wicked out the uh, screw post. Uh, doesn't look too bad. First thing I want to do is I want to get rid of the uh, bumpers. I want to take my X-Acto knife and get rid of the uh, where the hot knife did there. Get rid of that little bit of that flashing there, and they should just pop right out. Once again, I just took the X-Acto knife and cut off that little bit of flashing, and both the front and back bumper uh, come off there. Next thing I want to do is just kind of dry fit the new ones. Make sure everything lines up the way it should be before you go ahead and glue them in place. You know what? The front and back bumper, both. Absolutely yumminess. Look at that. Look at that. I mean, that looks 100% better right away. Still have to address the chassis. Uh, I, I know the chassis runs. I touch it to, to the transformer a bit ago. Sounds like it runs fine. Probably gonna oil it. Just go ahead and uh, change out the uh, for the smaller tires, and we should be getting this bugger on the track here shortly. Looks good. I got the uh, axles and tires and hubs uh, swapped out. I want to go ahead and put the uh, screws in, get the guide pin in, and get the body on the chassis. Just tighten the screws up here, and it is track time, guys. That's always my favorite part. You know what? Getting it done. There you go. And seeing it go around the track. Love it. Love it. Okay. A little bit of juice. Not the fastest one in the world. Very good, though. Looking sharp, looking sharp. And I did not, I did not, and I got to, I did not glue the bumpers in. They're holding in on their own. They're holding in on their own. So I yet have got to glue it in. But boy, much better it did than when it had all the decals on it. You know what? So we need to get to the uh, raffle here. I'm very excited about this. I'm going to go and shoot the side and show you what I'm talking about, uh, the names, and I'll be right back out here. All right, here is what I'm talking about. The uh, viewers here that have um, bought a ticket, once again, if it's five dollars a ticket, so if you give me five dollars through the PayPal, that's one ticket. If you give me ten dollars through PayPal, that's two tickets. And again, you're increasing your odds. I can't guarantee because you bought more tickets that you win, but you did increase your, the likelihood that you uh, will win. So let me go ahead and uh, get the names out. We'll put them into a hat or a box or something, and we'll draw the winner. Here's all the tickets with the names. I'm gonna fold uh, each one in half and then I'm gonna put them into a box and then I will do the drawing. Okay, I've just been folding them up here, putting them into a box. I got a, what I got a couple more here. And what we'll do is, let me show you the inside of the box. I got them all in there, guys. They're all folded up and we're just gonna mix them. 
so I don't know, have no idea. And quite frankly, I'm gonna turn my head the other way and I don't know who I'm gonna pick. Best of luck, guys, here we go. I got one, and who is it? Let's see who it is, guys. Chris Larkin, very good, sir. Well done, you've got the, uh, the, the, the Mack truck, I'm sorry, the, yeah, the Mack truck, the state truck, with the um, dump truck and the special little bonus back there. Congrats, very good, very good. Guys, um, $5 for that, you know, one entry, well done. All right, guys, I had a blast with the raffle, and Chris Larkin, you're gonna get uh, everything you see here. I need your uh, mailing address, and you can send it to me at uh, smokingtjets at gmail.com. My, uh, uh, my email should be up there on the screen right now. I had a blast uh, restoring the uh, vet here. I think it came out absolutely wonderful. I really do. I love the way it came out. All right, guys, uh, as always, let me know if you need anything. See ya.